tell me about the mural you're painting and I understand there's going to be some boys in the picture well, sooner there's, or later. There's going to be uh, representations of the boys. So uh, Andy and Annette, they own the building. They hired me to do a mural and the inspiration uh, from the very beginning is of their daughter. She's got this, you know, beautiful, wavy, curly hair. And uh, so they wanted something that kind of depict their daughter. So I suggested, well, what if we do it as a, you know, real portrait, really, you know, represent her completely. Uh, at the time, I didn't really know she had the two boys too. And then we talked, bit, talked about it further and she has three kids all together. So um, I said, well, why don't I put something in there that represents the boys? So she told me their personalities and both of, both of them were very creative, uh, love to make things, you know, they have an engineering mind and so forth. So I wanted to do local birds. And uh, so the, the two smartest birds that came up was the raven and the blue jay, just because of their personalities. And it's interesting what they can do and how they use different things as tools and they're very innovative. So I thought that was a good fit for the boys. So um, that's what the mural is. The center, the main focus is Wren, and her name is after the bird. And uh, and then so then we got a raven and a blue jay to represent the boy. So the blue jay is morphing from the background into the portrait, and then the raven is in the far uh, right hand corner. And uh, they're all going to be tied together with uh, an element of the of the mural as well. So it ties the three kids together. So. <laughs> It's a portrait of their three children. And you told me that you have a studio here in Loveland. I do. I have a studio in uh, Loveland Studios on Main Street. Uh, it's in the old school, which was also the shirt factory. Uh, we have openings there. There's, uh, there's about 30 artists there, and I'm just one of them. I'm in Studio 101 on the first floor, and uh, I do you know, lots of different things from portraiture, figurative to landscape. I teach there as well on Fridays and um, it's a good, good place. It's great having a studio. So it, how many uh, murals have you done like this? Well, I, ha I have not painted a mural myself in a while. I started my career that way back in the 80s and then I got into the commercial field. I have designed some murals so one currently going up right now is on the sam adams brewery building on the um, central parkway so they expanded their building i designed a mural for them through artworks uh, about five six years ago the building that it's on quadrupled in size so like they asked if i would come up with a way to expand the mural and uh, so I did. It's uh, it's a pretty ex it's it's a huge mural. So it's being painted through artworks. So right now there's a crew of 15 kids on involved in that, plus some teaching artists. And uh, the lady in charge is named Gypsy, a really sweet girl. And um, they're going to be adding to that number because there's so, there's so much work to be done. So that'll be completed, I think, in the end of September. That's the goal, put it that way. It's a teaching program. And uh, so if you're downtown, right at Finley Market, if you're looking west, you will see the mural. Okay. So, uh, no, 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 looking east, I'm sorry. Now I got to think, yeah. Looking, looking west, looking west, yeah. Okay. So, um, yeah, the murals over there. I'm kind of excited to see how that one comes out. So, it's different when you're painting your own and when uh, someone else is painting it for you. You told me the weather's really been playing havoc with you. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, but do you have some date in mind now when am I, this mural might be finished? I'm hoping in a week. Uh, okay. it, you know, it's getting really close. We're getting into the looser part. The, uh, the hard part of the portrait is done or very, you're very closely done. Uh, there's a lady by the name of Natalie who's helping me paint. She's friends of Annette and Andy and uh, she's the one that got me the contact. So she's also an artist and she wanted to help out and uh, she's been helping me uh, block in the colors and everything. Okay. So, uh, 
So hope, hopefully, in a week, a week plus, uh, I'm hoping it'll be done. Yeah. If the weather permits. Yeah. Well, good luck, Tom, with the weather. <laughs> the, the mirror already looks great, so you don't need any luck on that. And uh, thanks, thanks so much for letting me talk with you a little while. Well, thanks very much, Bill. I appreciate that. Hopefully, a lot of people can connect with it. So, thanks very much. Thanks for stopping by and talking. You're very welcome. <laughs> Bye now. Well, take care. Thanks.